cradle to cradle is a concept which allows to have a beneficial footprint. So it's not about guilt management, it's not about Dürsam height, it's not about sustainability, it's about innovation. We can now use 30 years of blaming and shaming to make far better products, far better architecture. We can reinvent all the products, all the landscape architecture, all the cities in a way that they can be good instead of less bad. This Aedes festival is very important for Cradle to Cradle because this is a very famous and prestigious architecture and design platform because Cradle to Cradle is all about architecture and design. It's not about recycling or downcycling. No, it's about reinventing all the products from the beginning. And Berlin is important because a lot of young designers come to Berlin and we want to inspire them with what's going on in the Netherlands because the Netherlands could become a blueprint for innovation for all, all over Europe and even for more other countries. This festival is basically organized like a kindergarten. So it's not about competing and having, oh, I am the most important one. No, to say, hey, everybody is important. Every day one party here has a birthday. And then everybody is important, whether it's Philips or Acts or DSM, or whether it's Van Houtum, just a small paper company. Everybody is important. And that makes a platform which is generating support and innovation. My colleague and friend Bill McDonough will come as well for a whole week in March where we can demonstrate how cradle-to-cradle -cradle architecture looks like. People can learn here by the, from the basic concept, but they can learn by innovation. They can learn from Mosa in Maastricht, for example, how to make a, a ceramic tiles which can go back in the technosphere, which are reversible as well, with new types of clues which come from Acta Nobel, for example. Or you can see how carpets can be used as services, you know, carpets which are cleaning the air, new paints from Acta Nobel which are actively cleaning air. So it's a whole platform, a kaleidoscope of innovation and it celebrates life and it celebrates human creativity. So there is a certain urgency in that as well. When you see that asthma in the Netherlands and Germany are by far the most relevant children's diseases, then you need to see, you need to change this now because asthma is not fun. And when you see that there is no legal limit for radioactivity in fertilizer, then we need to act now because we are otherwise contaminating the whole environment. When you're seeing that the European Union is mostly just pretending to do something to keep us busy, then we know it's up to us. It's now time to plan for the next generation, and that's this decade. So let's use the next 10 years to change our industrial system. We are here at the festival to show everybody that Cradle to Cradle, first of all, is possible. Desso is going to turn its company 100% in, uh, in Cradle to Cradle. So therefore, all the products, all the processes will be uh, Cradle to Cradle uh, uh, in, uh, in 2020. Secondly, that Cradle to Cradle makes money. And thirdly, that uh, we really want to uh, disseminate all our results and uh, show everybody that things are possible and show everybody that they should do the same thing. Start with cradle to cradle, very easy. I think design is the cradle because uh, we can make materials, we can make all kinds of, of products which in the end if they're not sold it's no use of making them. And the same for the regenerate materials. If not someone, a designer or an architect, is deciding that he's going to use that material to produce a product, he is not able to close the loop. And for closing the loop, the design, the initiative, as McDonald is saying, huh, that design is uh, the first signal of human intention, it's, it's really the cradle in my opinion. I think it's a fluently uh, system where one supports each other. Cradle to Cradle is most of the time seen, and luckily in the exhibit we see different examples, but most of the time seen as a product-based approach, where a product made out of this Cradle to Cradle idea of principles and this circular uh, way. Um, in the Netherlands we uh, developed in different projects, and, one, and some of them are shown here, in different projects on an urban level, that Cradle to Cradle is actually an alliances form of designing a new future of your cities. And it can be of existing cities, of industrial areas, of to or new to build cities. Cradle to Cradle is a way 
it's always different, it's always specific. Every situation, every building, every product, or every city has a different cradle-to-cradle -cradle approach. So there's no standard, there's no rules and regulations that can actually predict how to cradle-to-cradle -cradle develop your product or your city. But cradle-to-cradle -cradle is a way of incorporating, uh, it's an attitude. I'm convinced that all the issues we are facing at the moment uh, are more and more becoming urban issues, spatial issues, and we have to address them in a, 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 in a design approach. And there's this kind of complex relationship at the moment between politics and design, where politics and design, politics and the real content are uh, driven apart. We have to combine them again for a new urban agenda on, on a political level. And the whole festival that will take on to March is actually uh, uh, one big alliance forming uh, festival. And I think that's uh, uh, a very hopeful perspective. <laughs>